Good morning, friends. Greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado, registered pharmacist number 12275. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body. You are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we're here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy, I have seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure. Because the human biological system is a healing system, a regenerating system, it is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing, regenerating, renewing system a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you are dealing with a health challenge, please understand that it is in the body's nature to heal. It is in the body's nature to regenerate. Sure, it needs the raw materials to do its work. It needs oxygen to do its work. It needs a clean place to do its work. But given basic parameters, given basic criteria are met, that is nutrition, oxygen, and a clean place for the body for cells to do its work, the body's a regenerating system always till the day we die. If you're dealing with a chronic degenerative disease of any kind, let us help you. Let us help you change your life today. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you have questions about the longevity products, nutritional supplements, symptomology, skin health issues, if you want to contribute to our conversation or if you just want to share a success story, 844-236-6010 is our number on the bright side. If you want to purchase any of the longevity products you hear advertised on the program, check out my blogs, brightsideben.com, pharmacistben.com, criticalhealthnews.com. You can also call the phone team at 866-735-2470 and ask them about joining the Brightside Ben team. Love to have you on my team. We can help spread the word together. We can help change the world together. You can make some money. A lot of folks are making significant money. You can just get your products at the wholesale price if you so desire. Call the phone team at 866 735-2470. 735-2470. Tell them you want to join the Brightside Ben team, or you can sign up right from the websites criticalhealthnews.com, pharmacistben.com, or brightsideben.com. And if you want to check out our truth treatment products, including our retinol 5% gel and my skin health blog, please head to truthtreatments.com. And you can order uh, all the Truth Treatment products, Retinol 5% Gel, Truth Serum, Omega-6 Healing Cream, Truth Balm, right off the website. You can also check out my skin health blog. Okay, so we've been talking about the idea of distinctions in the body and distinctions in health. If we want to be optimally healthy, we've got to focus on the right place. Medicine practices misdirection. This is the classic magician's trick. It's classic politician's trick. Misdirection. Focus over here while we're picking your pocket over there. Oh, yeah, Trump, Palin, Cruz, la, 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 wall, all this hullabaloo that's going on. Our pockets are still getting picked. Our lives aren't going to be any better no matter who the bonehead is president, who the next bonehead president is. It doesn't matter because we're focusing on the wrong place. Likewise, in the body, we're focusing on the wrong place. We're focusing on symptoms. We're focusing on signs. We're focusing on tissues and and organs rather than cells. We're focusing on inflammation that we can see versus microinflammation that we can't see. We're focusing on test scores, on lower cholesterol and and, and TSH and insulin and and, uh, uh, blood glucose. We're focusing on the numbers rather than feeling good, rather than feeling vital, rather than recovering from our inflammatory or our chronic degenerative diseases. Medicine's failing us, folks. And it's failing us, at least in the realm of chronic disease. Remember, emergency medicine. Praise God for emergency medicine. I want to be very clear about that. Surgery, antibiotics, chemotherapy sometimes. Emergency medicine is not what we're talking about here. In terms of chronic degenerative disease, medicine has failed us. Utterly failed us. It an, gets an F minus, not even an F. If it could get a G, it would get a G. Whatever the lowest it can get. Sorry. That's just the facts. 
And it's failing us because it makes the wrong distinctions. It's focusing on symptoms rather than health, on, on tissues and organs rather than the cells. But here's the problem. There's big money in focusing on the wrong distinctions. We may not be getting better. We're getting sicker by the day. But drug companies are getting richer to the same, to the same degree we're getting sicker, the drug companies are getting richer. But what do you think this is about, folks? The medical model is making more and more and more money every year. They don't, you ever hear of a bad year for medicine? Do you ever hear of a bad year for a drug company? Do you ever hear of a drug company losing money? Do you ever hear the modern medical model losing money anywhere? No, never. They're, they're not going to kill the goose that laid the golden eggs either. That's why we're focusing on test scores and diagnostics and risk management. Lower your heart attack risk by 2.8%. doesn't matter how you feel. It doesn't matter that you feel like crap and you've got cold sores and you can't have sex and you're dizzy and you're confused and you're not thinking clearly and you have aches and pains. That doesn't matter. You're going to have a 2.8% less risk of having a heart attack. That's what counts. Because we have a, a medical model that's based on risk management. There's a really cool book called Risky Medicine by Robert Aronowitz. It talks all about how medicine is now about risk management. Do you ever hear anybody talk about risk management? That's another distinction. Real health versus risk management. So the medical model can make lots of money. They can charge us lots of money without having to worry about us getting healthy. All they got to do is worry about changing our test scores. And that way, by the way, we're locked in. Because now, if we stop taking our drugs, our test scores change. If you stop taking your statin drug, your cholesterol scores change. Your cholesterol numbers change. If the medical model focused on real health, eventually we wouldn't need the medical model. And, of course, that would be the end of the gravy train. And nobody's going to do that. Nope. Nobody's going to tell you that, folks. Once we're healthy, there's no more cash cow. Another important distinction is the body versus versus the organ, the entire body, the whole body versus the individual organ. Health and wellness are systemic. Health and wellness are the whole system. That's why nobody can just have polycystic ovarian syndrome or polycystic kidney disease. Nobody just has restless leg syndrome. got a call from a lady. I get letters all the time. People say, well, I'm perfectly healthy and I feel great except for my rheumatoid arthritis. And it's not like I want to curse people with being sick, but you've got to know that if you have rheumatoid arthritis, you're not perfectly healthy. I'm not kidding you, folks. I get letters every day that says, I have polycystic kidney disease, but other than that, I'm healthy. And this is how we think. It's not like we're dumb. This is just how we think. We don't recognize that the body is a system. No one just has migraines. No one just has Alzheimer's. No one just has restless leg syndrome. The body is an interconnected system. And that means the symptoms are systemic. They involve the entire system. They're interconnected. And you can no more treat just the gallbladder or address gallstones than you can treat a single leaf on a tree. You have a, if your tree, if the, you got mold all over your tree, you can't just treat a little square, square section of the, of the bark. You've got to treat the root. This idea of isolating individual components in the body despite the body's obvious integration, it's obviously connected. It's obviously interconnected. It's a vestige. It's an old way of looking at health that focuses on special parts and special diagnoses, diagnoses and special diseases. And it's created these specialists, a whole class of specialists who make lots of money for doing nothing, at least when it comes to restoring health. Has any specialist ever reversed Alzheimer's? Has any Alzheimer's specialist ever done anything for Alzheimer's patients? Has any Parkinson's specialist ever done anything for Parkinson's patient? This, is, this idea of having special diagnoses and special medicine is about specialists who make lots of money. When we understand that the body is integrated, we'll understand that specialists are useless for healing and completely unnecessary. And by the way, this is also this idea of looking at separate components rather than the big picture, the system, is a problem in how we look at the world. It's not just a problem in our health. It's responsible for a lot of our world misery. I'll tell you what I mean when we come back from our break. You're listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. 844-236-6010 is our number. Got lines open for you. We'll be back right after this. Thank you for listening to GCN. 
Visit GCNlive.com today. Okay, welcome back to the Bright Side. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We're on the air Monday through Friday, 8 to 9 Pacific and 10 to 11 Central Time, 24-7 on brightsideben.com archives as well as Ben Fuchs archives. Got lots of great information, five years of information. Not all health information, philosophical information. I like talking philosophically sometimes, but there's tons of health information, nutritional supplement information. That's what we talk about here on the Bright Side every day. That's what the Bright Side is all about. It's about the good news that says if we do this correctly, if we look at the right distinctions, if we understand where disease begins, we don't have to be sick. No matter what our chronic health challenge is, you could have had it for 20 years, and you can turn around and, folks, I can't even begin to tell you how many times I've seen this with my own ojos, my own eyes, not reading. Stuff you hear on this program is not stuff I've read. It's not necessarily stuff I've read. It's stuff I've experienced. And when I tell you chronic degenerative disease is reversible, type 2 diabetes, reversible, cancer, reversible, I'm not talking to you about necessarily what I've read. I'm talking to you about what I've seen. Nobody has to suffer, and indeed, suffering is the right word because that's what happens. When, if you're listening to this program and, and praise God you're healthy, please understand that there are people who are suffering every day. And if you're one of those people who are suffering, please understand it is, doesn't have to be that way. Anyway, that's why we call this program the Bright Side. Let us help. I want to be your health advocate. That's my role. That's, you know, that's, what, that's my raison d'etre. I want to be your health advocate, your skin advocate, your skin care advocate, your product advocate. And that's what this program is about. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you have questions about health, nutrition, prescription drugs, if you want to wean yourself off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, or if you just want to contribute to our conversation, 844-236-6010 is our number. All right, so this idea of looking at the, the parts, looking at the trees rather than the forest, it's, it's based on this old way of looking at, looking at the world in general. In the Bible, uh, it says, uh, Jesus says, whatever I have done, he says, whatever you've done to the least of my brothers, you did to me. He's telling you, holographic theory right there. It's all connected. People say, oh, yeah, that means you've got to give money to the poor, and you've got to help poor people, and you've got to be nice to poor people and sick people and, and suffering people. Maybe that's true, but when I read that, it sounds to me like Jesus is telling us that everything's connected. What you have done to my gallbladder, you've done to my body. What you've done to my, my uterus, you've done to my body. It's telling you the whole thing's connected. And, and we have to change or shift our perspective if we're really going to be able to leverage this amazing healing property of the body. If you pay attention to uh, politics, I, I, I'm, it's getting harder, I must admit, to pay attention to it. But, you know, I pay attention to the news and current events. You know that there's this discussion going on about immigration and the greatness of America. And we're going to make America great again. But what we're witnessing in the United States and around the world is a melting of borders, a disintegration of borders. It's happening everywhere. Nations are becoming blended. Humanity is spreading from country to country. From Europe is becoming African and Muslim. The United States is becoming Hispanic. All of America, North America and South America, is kind of getting blended together. The European continent and the African continent is getting blended together. The third world is moving to the first world. The have-nots are moving to the haves. There's a steady migration from undeveloped countries to developed countries. Borders and, and nations are becoming irre less relevant, irrelevant. And we can build wars, we can fight war, we can build walls, we can fight wars to try to keep people out, but it is a fool's errand, like spitting into the wind. It's useless. It's inevitable. That's because of the technology of the Internet. That's because of technology and the World Wide Web and YouTube. YouTube, in the last five years... You know, you have revolutions, YouTube revolutions. Just be, over the last 10 years, 5, 10 years, the world has changed so much over the last 5 or 10 years. And we're still looking at things in this backwards way. Nations and countries are fabricated anyway. Nations and countries are constructions, are invented. They're from the Middle Ages. This idea that we can carve the world up into countries, into parts. It's like a, it's like a, the way we look at the body, we look at the world. Now, I'm not saying this is a good or bad thing, by the way. I'm not making a judgment on what's happening, this disintegration of the nation state. That's what's happening. I'm not making a judgment here. I'm just saying.